Hey guys, it's Dan with Tools in Action. Uh, today we're going to do a well-known product from Passload. It's the CF325 30 degree cordless uh, framing nail. So, first thing you're going to notice when you get this is it comes in a nice blow molded durable orange case. If you open it up, what I really like about this case is it's not one of those cases where you have to figure out where things go. It actually says right on it where the things go. So you got your fuel cell, you got a battery, you got the actual tool, you have a charger, you have your hex wrench, uh, wall charger fits right in there, and it says right on it, and it comes with safety glasses. Also included is Passload's um, 800 number, an easy walkthrough cleaning guide, and just a few steps on how to uh, work with the tool. All right, going over the tool, uh, it's nice and lightweight, about seven and a half pounds with the battery. Battery charge time takes about two hours. You're going to get about 4,000 nails off the actual battery charge and 11 to 1,300 nails on the uh, fuel cell here. So going over the tool, it's a nice, durable ABS plastic. They redesigned the, uh, the nose here so it grips at any angle. So you're not, you know you're not going to be sliding. Uh, as with any tool, whenever you're, any actual nailer, when you're playing with it, not playing, but maneuvering it around, you always want the battery out of it and the fuel out of it so it doesn't accidentally fire. They do have safety features built into the tool, but it's like a gun. It is dangerous. You can do some damage. So I uh, definitely have to be careful around a tool like this. Um, another thing that I noticed that I really like is right here you can adjust your depth just by lifting up here and sliding that in and out. And that will adjust your nail depth. So, so I know some tools you have to put in the hex wrench, loosen it up, and, you know, it just takes time. This is real quick, real easy to do. Um, it does come with the included hex wrench, which allows you to take this apart and clear out a nail jam. So uh, I'll show you how we load fuel into it. Basically, this latch opens up here. You get to grab your fuel, slide your fuel right in there, close it down, and then it's securely locked. That's your fuel. Your fuel's in the place. Same thing with the battery. Quick slide. Slides right in there. Locks. I'm not going to put the battery in it right now because I don't want it to accidentally fire. Um, this is also, you uh, You can use it with uh, Passload's new fuel and nail pack combos. Uh, another thing to note about these new combos is they work with legacy Passload tools. So if you have a three or four year old uh, framing nailer and you've been looking at the new fuel and nail combo packs and wanted one, they now include adapters in every pack so you can use them with your tool, which is a great idea. Uh, I know everybody's been going crazy over these combo packs. So we're going to show you how to insert nails into it. Basically you have a quick slide right here, you're just going to slide it back, drop your nails into the chamber, push the button. Lock forward. That's it. You're ready to nail. Just put the battery in and go. So uh, a couple more features uh, that I noticed about this tool is the actual utility hook here. It kind of has a... It, it's one of the first I've ever seen like this. Uh, you can have it really close on your tool belt here, but if you have a wider uh, bag or something that you need to click it on, you just push up and it slides out to the other side. And you have all this room now to hang your nailer off your belt or whatever you may be working on. So, a couple other uh, notes that we're going to go over the tool here is it shoots about two to three nails per second. Um, it holds 48 nails on the one strip that we put in there. Uh, we talked about it weighing about seven and a half pounds with the battery. Okay, so the CF25, uh, let's go over some dimensions of the actual tool. The length of the tool is about a foot, it's 12 inches long. It's about 14 and a half inches high and four inches wide. So uh, it's kind of a compact design for uh, a big nailer like as it is. It does about um, one strip of nails, which is 48 nails. The nail ranges from two to three and a quarter inch nails in length, which is good. Uh, the angle of the nails is 30 degrees, which we talked about. Uh, Pastel does include a one year full warranty and a five year limited warranty on this tool. Um, it's a real quality tool. We like it a lot. It lasts about 50,000 nails before you're going to have to clean the tool and like I said they include a cleaning guide and they also have cleaning products uh, if you want your tool to last you're going to have to clean it with, as with any uh, high performance tool you definitely want to keep it clean it's your money maker, it's your lifeline, you want it to last 
So, like I said, real easy tool. You just drop the fuel in, drop the nails in, and you're ready to go to work. So, uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to show you it in action. Okay, so now we're going to do the toe angle and kind of show you how this thing works here. So, we'll just put this up right here. And then we'll take her in at an angle. So, as you can see, the nail's still sticking out a little bit there. So, the good thing about this tool is real quick, we can adjust our depth just by lifting here and pushing in. So, now I'm going to go a little deeper on the next one. And as you can see, that thing's in there. Um, we're using the uh, new uh, Power Boost nails from their new combo packs, which have like a black, uh, black tip coating on them, which allows for extra grab. So... It's just like screwing in. So what we'll do here is if you can come around this way, we'll just do another one right here. So as you can see, goes right through, not a problem. Okay, so it does about one to uh, two nails per second. Um, and as you can see, we were just playing with it here, and obviously it's way too deep for me. So it went right deep into it. So again, we'll go back to the adjustments, adjust it out a little bit, and we'll see what she can do. So as you can see, it'll go as fast as you can pretty much nail. Um, no jams, real clean. We like that a lot. And the angle is just awesome. We love that. So what I want to do is I'm going to do another angle for you guys. But obviously I'm going to want to go in deeper. Quick adjustment. I love that quick adjustment. I don't have to whip out a tool or nothing like that. And you're just ready to go. So Look at that. Right in there. So if I was framing a house right now, I'd probably be halfway done. So that's uh, the pass load. CF325 cordless framing nailer and uh, what we're going to do is we're going to hopefully get this out on a couple job sites here real soon and get some feedback from some uh, contractors about it and see what they like about the tool. It's definitely a professional tool. It's definitely a high performance tool. Um, I know if I was a framer this would be my number one tool in my arsenal. So if you'd like to see more about this tool you can go to passload.com. You can also visit www toolsinaction.com to see more reviews and don't forget to visit our sponsor acmetools.com